building sustainable family and uh, community life. The word sustainable comes from the verb sustain, to give support or relief to, to supply with, keep up, prolong, to support the weight of, to buoy up, sustain, bear up, under, sustain heavy uh, loss. That, that goes in, into it also, sustain heavy losses. To support as in true, legal, and just, allow or admit as valid. The court sustained the motion to support by adequate proof, confirm. The word sustainable is, uh, is uh, very profound. And that's what we need to our, our families and, and community. And it, it mentions building, building sustainable uh, family and community life. Family, it has to be constructed again. And so we have to have uh, a family that is sound and whole and working together. In the Holy Quran, it says Allah created us from nations and tribes and into you know, communities so that we may know each other. Yeah, we're one community. It's all connected. Today is Savior's Day. Savior's Day evolved to where Imam Muhammad changed it to Savior's Day to reflect all those that helped save us. Then, of course, we have to start with Allah. Allah, he saved us. And uh, by sending us the help and everything that we needed. Uh, we uh, used to call ourselves black gods. Everyone, every man was a god. And here, uh, these guys had to go to the bathroom, eat, sleep, and everything like that. And uh, we believe that. So when Imam Muhammad came in and began to pull the mythology out of what was labeled as Al-Islam and uh, started teaching us the Quran, Imam Muhammad, he had to connect us to the, to the Quran so that we could read the Quran. We realized that which was added in, twisted and turned in the other scriptures, in the hands of other people, had to be straightened out and the Quran straightens it out. All you who believe, save yourselves and your families uh, from a fire whose fuel is men and stone. And it has more to it. But here, Allah is telling us that we have to save. It says, oh, you who believe. If we believe, we have an obligation to save ourselves. We got to save ourselves first. And we save our family. And the fire we're talking about is the fire of sin, a fire of a false belief, a fire of associating God with God. So uh, we need to build sustainable family and community life. And the first thing is the one God. You got to get that established. And then you have to follow the lifestyle of the prophet. 